Hey you guys, so it's Samantha as you can see um, self recording because I felt like I should just record this experience. I'm trying to make some herbal oil mix with chamomile leaves that I just bought at the herbal food store. So right now I'm going to do it with avocado oil, jojoba oil and coconut oil. Basically using avocado oil as like my base because I kind of use like um, about a, a fourth cup of it which is like four ounces and then I use like a cup of chamomile flower leaves. And then I just use like, you know, a teaspoon of coconut and a teaspoon of jojoba oil. And now I'm going to try to do this infused oil mix to see if it really works. Since we know chamomile is great for dandruff, it's great for hair thinning, it's great for actually stopping breakage. So I figured why not try to make this herbal oil mix, wait 24 hours, and then let you guys see if it really came out like a good infused oil mix. So here we go. All right, y'all. So as you can see, this is my chamomile. Look at it. I'll pick up one so you can see what it looks like. It looks like um, little flowers in a sense. But this is my chamomile. And then this is my oil. It has already the avocado in it, the coconut, and the jojoba. So what I'm going to do now is take this and this and put it in my mason jar. And I'll let you guys know what I'll do next. Alright y'all. So this is how it's looking. Um, I ended up adding about two more ounces of the coconut oil and about a half an ounce of the jojoba oil because of the fact that I just felt like there just wasn't enough oil in here. Like it was kind of towards the bottom and there was a lot of leaves and I just didn't want to waste any of the leaves. So I kind of wanted to get more saturated. So, um... Yeah, this is it. Now, I'm going to basically take it and put it in some boiling hot water. Let it boil together for about 30 minutes. Then just have it sit out for the night. Um, wait 24 hours and then come back tomorrow. So, for me, it'll be 24 hours. And for you, it'll be like 25 seconds. All right, you guys. So, it's been about 24 hours. I'm going to pick it up just so you can see um, how it looks. Like, the flowers are all drenched with oil because it's been soaking overnight you may not see a difference looking at it but i noticed a difference because when you smell the oil it smells just like chamomile oil so what i'm going to do now is i'm going to take it i'm going to take the flowers and drain it so i have my strainer already prepped and ready so i'm just going to strain this and then i'm going to just use the oil you notice I use the strainer because I actually don't want any of the flowers within my oil. So I'm shaking it out right now one time just to get everything out. And then what I normally do is I'm going to actually just shake it to get the last bit of oil. Um, and then I'm just going to squeeze it out just to get the remaining pieces that's still left. Because as you can see, the flowers are still so saturated. Then it's ready to get used. If you want to keep some of the flowers in for just decoration purposes, you're more than welcome to do that. For me, I don't really need it because I'm going to put this right in my hair directly. But that's it. That's it for the herbal oil. That's it. Very simple. Easy peasy.